Okay, here you can see what I'm doing. I just have one of the supercells ringed with a wrap of LED strips. They're in silicone. I'm uh, in place. See, what you want is isolation. So what you would do ideally is really simply just go to the hardware store and get a strip of LEDs and uh, form it around the lens, but put a mask over top of it like this, not over top of the lens, but over top of the light. So the light is only shooting into the cell. That way you could actually, see I can't actually bring the darkness down enough. That way you're actually looking into the cell instead of the blinding white LEDs. I think that's pretty simple. That's the trick. Two words, recessed lighting, recess. So you make this out of PVC or anything. You can see I just wrapped it around there really quickly. It's just a LED strip. Mm -hmm, they're pretty bright, but that's it. And uh, while you think you would want uh, red, green, blue, you actually want bright white. And they have a sticky backing on them. And uh, you can get like a strip of these for 20 bucks. And you need a wall wart, so the total will be like 30 bucks. And then you just build a mask out of black cardboard. Or something, and ideally also you get better contrast, is if you actually put the black cardboard or black paper on the back of the cell. Because we're not talking about lenses that you look through here, we're talking about fields that penetrate anything and absolutely everything. So, yeah, I know I've got fingerprints all over this right now. But anyway, I have three cells available, and I'm not going to go into production on these things. I figured, well, I'll just use up all my glass while I'm at it. And uh, if I'm going to get messy, my fingertips, look at, look at that. Look how dirty that is. Oh, my God. Uh, fingertips are stained and covered with uh, optical cement. Yeah, no. So, anyway, it's as simple as that. A strip of uh, white LEDs and uh, some sort of mask. Thanks for watching. Bye.